Easy Mind, Easy Life, and I'm Holly Bell. So we are back, well and truly now. <laughs> so in this video, um, as I've gone through my morning, I wait, you know, for little messages as to what they want me to talk about. And today, the very first thing that came up was a lovely piece of wisdom that I learned while I was doing my life transformational coaching course. And that is, how do you know if you're in belief or if you're living in the truth, right, of what is? How do you know if you're looking at life through the eyes of belief or are you looking at life through the eyes of truth and it's really really very simple and it was something that as soon as I heard it it resonated with me straight away I, I knew that that was it now when something is true it is true for you and it's true for your neighbor and it's true for your family and it's true for your country but it's true for everybody in the world it's not just true for a certain type of people and it doesn't it's not true for others. When it's the truth, it's the truth for everyone and everything. That's a life. So let's say that again. When you are living in truth, the truth is true for you, for everyone around you, all right? For everyone on the planet and for everything. So, say for example, you are not sure whether you're looking at something through the eyes of love, through the eyes of truth, or if you're looking at something through the eyes of belief, right? Something that you've put in place at some point in your life, right? So we'll come back to beliefs later, but let's see the difference between the two right now. So a belief would be something like, I'm not good enough. Well. Is that truth? Is that true for everyone on the planet? Is it true for everything on the planet? Is everything on the planet not good enough? Is everyone on the planet not good enough? When you look at yourself as you're not worthy, I'm not worthy to receive. Well, is everyone else on the planet not worthy to receive? Is everything else on the planet not worthy to receive? And here's, here's something, okay, just we're trying to get out of our mindset. We're trying to get ourselves out of this box, right? Out of these little cages that we've put, you know, we've placed these cages in our minds from way back, right? And I'm trying to help you get out of those cages, destroy them forever <laughs> and be free right that is the purpose of these videos to let go of all those old beliefs all those old lies right that you've been hanging on to forever and a day we want to let go of all that so how do you know if it's true for you and for everyone and for everything just one simple thing okay let's have a look at the sun okay when it rises in the morning do you think the sun comes up in the morning and says well you know what mm, today you know I'm, I'm really feeling that that group over there is not good enough so I'm not going to shine for them I'm just going to keep my light over here for this group because this group is good enough for my sunshine today so I'm just going to shine over here and that group can do without sunshine for a few weeks now because they're not good enough the sun sits there and thinks these these people are good enough I'm gonna shine for them these people aren't good enough I'm not gonna shine for them no the Sun just rises and it shines for everyone and everything there's truth right there the Sun doesn't judge if you're good or bad or right or wrong or good enough or worthy or not worthy <laughs> it shines it just comes up every day. It shows up every day. It's there for us every day. By the way, it's there for us every day, loving us. And that's just the sun. 
there's a million things I could talk about. The birds, when they sing in the trees, do you think they get up on certain trees and go, oh, we'll sing for this person because this person is, is good enough for my song. But, you know, I won't sit in that tree over there because those people, they're not good enough for my song. Do you see where I'm going with all that? So a bird will sit in a tree and it will sing because it can. Not because you're worthy or not worthy or good enough or not good enough. It sings because that's what it was born to do, to sing. And it will sing for you whether you are good enough or you're not good enough, whether you're good or bad or right or wrong. The bird will still sing regardless of you. And it sings for everyone and everything because it can. It doesn't sit in judgment that, oh, I'm going to share my beautiful song with this person, but not that one over there. And the same goes for all your beautiful flowers in your garden. They don't bloom because, oh, she's worthy of my love. I'm going to blossom for her. Flowers don't do that. They don't judge. <laughs> they blossom because they can because they're so full of joy and love and oh, just life that they just blossom without a thought as to what garden they're in. They don't care if you're worthy, not worthy, good, bad. They don't care. Flowers will just blossom. Unless you've gone way out of your way to not water it and to try and destroy this poor flower before it has a chance to blossom, then that's a different story. But you know, the sun shines for these flowers every day. And the sun doesn't decide it likes, it prefers a certain kind of flowers to other flowers. No, the sun shines for all flowers. The rain comes down to water those flowers. And the rain doesn't decide, oh, I'm just gonna water those because I really like those. Those are worthy of my love today. I'm not gonna water those. Those are weeds. I don't like those. The rain doesn't have any judgment either way. The rain just rains for all. And that is truth and that is love. When you're not sure, always look to nature. Look to the sun, to the moon, to the birds, to the trees. Look to all of it because the answers, the truth is always there. It's staring you right in the face. <laughs> always. So that's how you know if your mindset is in love, like if you're looking at the world through the eyes of love, through the eyes of truth, of what is, or if you're looking at it through your beliefs. And the beliefs are that, I'm good enough, I'm not good enough, I'm worthy, I'm not worthy, and the list goes on forever and ever and ever. I'm fat, I'm thin, I'm stupid, I'm smart, I'm tall, I'm... Uh, it goes on, right? We have judgments and beliefs all day long about ourselves, about others, but they're not the truth and they're not love. Love is love, is love, is love. It doesn't judge, it has no beliefs, it just is. And it is there for all, for all, for everyone, for everything, always. All right, my darlings, sit with that beautiful thought today. Mm, see what happens to your heart. Does it start to open even just a little bit? Just a little bit. All right, remember to click like and subscribe so you don't miss any of the messages. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.